Are you serious? Are you serious? The Dwarf Planet series. The Dwarf Planet series. This is an actual picture taken by NASA from the probe that is on its way to this Dwarf Planet series. These two bright lights has perplexed NASA as the probe is approaching. Now, right now, the probe, called the U.S. Dawn, is 29,000 miles away from the dwarf planet, Ceres. On March the 6th, this probe, Dawn, will be in orbit with this dwarf planet, Ceres, and the camera should be able to do a much better job in identifying what is the source of these two very bright lights. Are these, is this, you know, this is certainly a reflection. And, you know, I mean, I would, in my opinion, it's, it's some type of reflection from uh, the sun. Uh, but as this, this dwarf planet, first of all, is in between Jupiter and Mars, okay? Uh, the images are were taken by the U.S. probe Dawn, 29,000 miles away from the dwarf planet Ceres. The light appears to be in the same basin as the other spot. According to the images released by NASA, this may be pointing to a volcano-like origin of the spots, but we will have to wait and see once we get better resolution, says NASA. The Dawn probe will enter the orbit of Ceres on March 6th. Scientists expect to receive better views of the mystery lights as the spacecraft closes in and spirals near the dwarf planet. The brightest spot continues to be too small to uh, resolve with our camera, but despite the size, it is brighter than anything else on Ceres. Now, this is truly unexpected. It's still a mystery to NASA. Now, there was some thoughts that maybe some type of water might actually be on Ceres. Again, Ceres is in between Mars and Jupiter. It's the largest dwarf planet in our solar system, and they're actually going to come very close to it in the next week. So we'll continue to let you know more about this. I, I know there's an explanation for it. I certainly feel that it's a reflection. The question is, what is it reflecting off of that would bring such a bright, brilliant light to lights? And God, you know, you know, God, when God created this universe, you know, he had a tremendous sense of humor. He knew that men would, would climb into the heavens. He even said that. And I don't think we have any idea how to unlock the mysteries of the universe, nor understand the knowledge and the depth of God. And remember, his ways are so much higher than our ways than the heavens are the earth. And so certainly, uh, this is a fascinating photograph being released today by NASA of the Dwarf Planet series. Been a lot of talk about the dwarf planet Nubiru or Planet X or Dwarf Star, they like to call it, or Planet 7X, as Gil Brizard likes to call it. But certainly, um, there's anticipation of it intersecting, not colliding, but intersecting with the Earth next year, according to Gil Brizard's calculations it could actually be next passover march 26th 2016 and may bring some biblical signs we'll wait and see i know this jesus is coming and i can see all the signs pointing of his return are you saved give your life to jesus christ he is coming soon